My name is Norbert and this is my um, Triumph TR6. It's a uh, 1969 model, uh, Royal Blue. Uh, I bought this 10 years ago and it's taken me that long to restore it back to original condition. And uh, we just kept it as original as possible, except for a few enhancements. Um, slightly different colour seats, instead of having black seats I went for a lighter colour upholstery. So uh, to uh, set off the dark, uh, dark blue colour, mini light uh, um, uh, mag wheels are very similar to the uh, what you could buy as an option on the TR6s when uh, when they first come out of the factory. This car uh, car was built in approximately November of 1968. At the time, the cars of this vintage were not dated by the year they were made. They were dated by when they were sold. So no TR6 was sold before 1969, so hence this is a 1969 model. Yeah, but uh, by today's standards, it's really a 68. The um, interior is uh, basically standard, but with later model uh, gauges. It's got a, a, a Jarra veneer dashboard, a good Australian Jarra. Jarra. And, um, Everything, uh, the upholstery and that was all done uh, locally. This, this one was done locally by a bloke in, uh, I'd met uh, in uh, an upholstery in Seven Hills and did a uh, very nice job on it. It's all leather, it's not vinyl, so uh, just for a bit of extra comfort. The, uh, the hood, hood is uh, a mohair hood as a modern material rather than uh, a vinyl which all adds to the uh, look of the car and I believe in you you're spending that sort of money uh, to uh, just to spend that little bit of extra and uh, just enhances the look of it. The, um, basically the uh, car came from America, I bought it from a uh, dealer in Melbourne, he imported it from the States because you basically can get these virtually uh, rust free uh, or as little as rust free as you could possibly get with the TR but um, and then uh, start a restoration from there. The, this was a complete nut and bolt restoration. It, uh, the body came off and the chassis was straightened, rebuilt, completely, uh, completely repaired. The body was completely repaired front and back and reinserted on the chassis and then the build up from there. It's a very good car to drive and a very drivable car and a good driver's car, I believe, anyway. So, yeah, I'm quite happy with the, uh, the finished outcome.